What's going on guys? It's me, Mr. Mugwell, back with another video, and today is going to be another shoe review of some NBA Timberlands, okay? Timberlands. Did I say Timberlands? I'm stupid. So I've done a couple videos like this in the past, just shoe review, and the viewership has been well, so that must mean you guys like them, so I hope you like this one too. Let's get right into it. You don't like the headband? Okay, so these boots, as you see, they came out a couple years ago, and they're a mashup between the NBA and Tim's. It's actually the NBA East and West. Hence, um, the blue laces here and the red laces here. So these originally retailed for around 250, but you can find them for a lot cheaper now, and I'll leave the links in the description. So personally, when wearing them, I haven't worn them too much. They are really, really comfortable, and they're a little heavy, and they are really high, high quality. However, let me put that one down. Um, as you see, all the individual logos on here, uh, hopefully this is focusing, um, they can scratch off pretty easily, so you don't want to wear and tear these every day. As you see um the red tipped laces and the blue tipped laces are actually a really cool feature and as you know if you're an nba fan blue represents the east red represents the west in the all-star game right but yeah outfit wise they go really well with jeans and a hoodie or, or a basketball jersey or any jersey of any kind but like why would you wear an nfl jersey with these for real one huge no-no. Do not use these as hiking boots or regular use outside boots, you know what I'm saying? Especially if you want these things to stay clean, look fly. Uh, why would you use these as outside boots in the first place? I don't know. Personally, how I'd rate these, I'd rate them an 8 out of 10. I personally got a couple sizes big. If you guys want to know, these are an 11 and a half size men's and I'm about a 10. Uh, they fit really well. They're actually a little too big. So I had to get these soles that are on the inside to actually make my foot feel them better. And there wasn't all this like, I wouldn't get blisters, right? All right. Let me know if you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be the end of the video today. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys. Peace. Hope this helped.